guys, welcome back to my channel, new season. I took a little break, uh, I think it was like two months that I didn't film any YouTube video. We went to Italy uh, to visit my family, like we stayed all of the summer holidays of Emma school and when I'm with Emma, I can't really film a YouTube video. So now Emma is back to school and I'm back with the weekly videos. Um, today's video, it is a sort of like collective haul. It's like some new pieces I've ordered last week, um, fall pieces of course, and uh, fall pieces but that I'm gonna take into winter as well. So for example, I'm gonna style them at the moment in a more fall way, I guess. The weather is about 16 to 20 degrees in Amsterdam at the moment, so I'm still wearing sandals, but then with the blazer So like that kind of styling which is basically my favorite styling of the year because I can mix and match summer spring and winter pieces so very playful love it and then of course all of these pieces I can take into winter styling as well as always, everything is going to be linked down below in the description box. Um, maybe for the more expensive pieces, I can see if I can also find some more affordable options. Um, but yeah, just check the description box and uh, I'm going to go through, uh, as usual, like the fitting, the styling and uh, the fabric composition. And uh, yeah, we're back. At work. The first piece I want to start with is new a new pair of denim. I've been quite excited to order two, order two, two new pair of jeans. I haven't been wearing any denim for the whole summer in Italy, so I, I was wearing jeans on the on the plane on the way to Italy. Never wore them again. Wore them back after six weeks on the way back to Amsterdam. It was so hot. So I basically, yeah, for the last two months, I haven't been wearing jeans. And then I think that was jeans and blazers uh, were the things that were, you know, making me looking forward to fall the most in terms of clothing. And uh, so I've ordered this new pair. Um, what I love about this, like the fit is amazing, but also look at the color. It is a sort of like, it's called dark wash, but it looks gray. So I don't have any jeans in this color and uh, on the website they look more blue while when I opened them and I put them on, I was like, they're almost gray. So really like this shade uh, for fall winter. They are from uh, Super Down on Revolve. It is quite a good uh, price point, they are 78 euros and then now when you order on Revolve the import fees are included in the price and uh, I think now they have like warehouses in Europe as well because um, it comes really fast like I think 3-4 days I got my order in so excellent uh, so it is a straight leg with a raw M you can see it in detail um, five pockets and then there is a zip fastening like no buttons and uh, it's quite high waisted so I felt that the fitting was like really really good I like the length as well you know I'm quite tall um, and you can see them better in the cutaway and they are 100% um, cotton uh, so yeah like I think this is gonna be one of my go-to jeans for the fall Next up is a basic, it's a tank top, uh, it's from Anin Bing. I love, I love Anin Bing in general. I love all of the pieces that I see on the website. I'm wearing Anin Bing today as well. If you want later I can show you better the pieces that I'm wearing. This is like a white oversized t-shirt with like Kate Moss on it. Uh, the shoes I'm wearing today are also Anin Bing and the blazer. And this tank top, I have it also in white. If you follow my Instagram, I've been wearing it a lot in the summer. And then I wanted another one and I was like, should I go for black or gray? 
And I didn't have any like grey tank top and I think it looks really good also under like a black blazer or for this like transition tra for this transitional weather. Uh, so yeah, I went for grey. I come a little bit closer so you can see it. But you know, it's 100% cotton. I think it looks like, you know, very normal when you see it like this, but there's something about it, like the fitting, it is really good. It's 87 euros, uh, but I've been wearing the white one the whole summer, washed it a lot, because of course like a white tank top in the summer is like wear and wash, wear and wash all the time. And it's holding up perfectly, so I think it is quite worth it, and because it is quite of a statement cut, so I've been wearing, for example, the white one just with like midi skirts or like shorts and it's just kind of like a statement cut, so I think it is a really nice basic to have. I think I've ordered, yeah, size medium, um, yeah, it's like just true to size and um, it comes in black and white and grey. Here the jeans and the tank top with this blazer which is also an Um It is still a little bit warm for this so when I put it on I was a bit like okay this is luckily it's still too hot uh, but you know it's a matter of days in Amsterdam. Um, it's like a fishbone blazer. I don't think this is new of this season because I remember this from last winter as well and it was on my wish list from last year. I love the vintage touch of it um, and the fabric. I must come closer because can you see that? So it's like beige, like sort of camel black and then the fabric has, I don't know if you can see it, has like little more colorful dots, you can barely see it. You need to come very, very close to see it. But I just think it gives like a really nice lighting to it. This is a pricey piece, but it is a wardrobe staple. So I think if it's your style, like a fishbone blazer, I think it is a true staple in a fall winter wardrobe. You can style it very easily even just with like a white t-shirt and jeans or I really like it for example with like leather trousers like leather leggings more like in winter time with a black turtleneck underneath like a go-to for fall winter it is 399 euros but as I said it is an investment piece that will stay in my wardrobe like most probably like forever. <laughs> the cut it is a menswear blazer inspired. I went for a size medium because it comes already a little bit oversized so you can go through to size in this one and if you prefer um, a different color combination for example it also comes in black and white. I already have something similar in black and white so I went for the camel and black uh, and I love it. And it is a uh, Italian wool blend uh, material. So excellent fabric composition. I can double check. Yeah, it is 42% um, Italian wool. The black blazer, it is also Anin Bing from last winter. But I believe that these are like staple pieces that they always keep on coming back on the website so I can link it down for you. Uh, it is also like a wool blend combination, like of course fully lined. These blazers are really well made. They're not meant to last one season. Like it's something that it just stays in your wardrobe. And then underneath it is also an Anin Bing t-shirt with Kate Moss on it. So I've got this t-shirt from the spring summer but I don't know like I had this styling in mind and I really wanted to wear it with like jeans and blazer but of course it was too hot for it so first week I'm back and then I'm already wearing it like I really had this styling in mind I'm wearing a size large in the t-shirt I'm just gonna stay like this now because it's very warm <laughs> and uh, yeah just like 
casual for like weekdays. Uh, I'm doing the school run in a little bit, so this is gonna be my outfit of today. And uh, yeah, I just think it's cool. And then the um, slides that you see in all the cutaway um, are also from Anin Bing. Like these I also had from the beginning of summer, wore them a lot before going to Italy, didn't bring them with me because like of course they are like slides but to be honest because of this like padded leather they're like quite warm so I'm wearing these a lot these days because it's like open but it's not those like super summery sandals if you know what I mean so I think for like these transitional outfits like they are perfect and then you have like this cross over um, effect they are super comfortable like look they are like really well made so love this and they come if you don't like black I love it the black but I also really like there is like a sort of like caramel, co caramel color uh, sage green that of course is very trendy this season but I always prefer to go for like classic pieces that I can wear next year as well and uh, so I just went for the black. Next up is a pair of uh, beige trousers, also another uh, staple piece for me. Um, and they are really well made, like quite elegant as well. They do come with a matching blazer, but it's like it's a cropped blazer. So I just, personally, I just went for the pants. I didn't get the blazer. I link the blazer for you as well, but I just personally got the trousers and they are really nicely lined inside uh, and then they close like this so there is this string and then so you close it like this and then you can make a little ribbon so I think it is a really nice detail when and you can just wear it with like I'm just planning to wear it with like, at the moment, like a white t-shirt, these, like even just with sneakers and like a trench coat, uh, because these are quite, let's say, dressy pants, so you can create that like casual chic look with more sporty pieces. Um, they are kind of a cropped style and um, they come through to size, so I went for my regular size, that is size medium, so I didn't size up in this and they just fit really well and these are, um, I think 300 euros, so quite expensive but they fit really well. So what I found personally is that sometimes to have like that very good fit for trousers you have to go a little bit more expensive because um, the high street, especially if you're like quite tall, it doesn't always fit so well for my body shape at least. Next up is a mid-weight knit, so it is a wool blend, wool and cotton blend, but it's not very heavy so it's perfect to wear at the moment and it is sleeveless. I love gilets, I wear these a lot, like I like them now sleeveless but also like in winter with like a shirt underneath or a turtleneck. Um, and I sized up to a size large because I like these to like be quite big that they, I don't like when they sit really narrow on my hips. Um, so it's a size large, it is 50% cotton and 50% wool. The price is 265 and uh, um, I love the color. It is from a brand from Revolve, it's called Weekend Stories uh, and I come closer so you can see it the color better, so it's sort of like oatmeal color. Next up is a jacket, is a jacket, so it's in between a shirt and a jacket. Um, it was quite, it's been quite trendy the past couple of years and now it just became like a, like a classic piece to wear, like when you want to wear something like very casual. Uh, so for me, for like school run or like running errands, so like this sort of styling, uh, or like this sort of occasions, um, I wear this a lot. I had another one as well that I got like I think two years ago from Cezanne. Um, so 
I show you the color and the fabric. It's like a sort of like denim, but like really thin denim. So it is something that if you normally wear a denim jacket, this is a good alternative to a denim jacket and it is 100% cotton. Uh, and I went for a size large because I want to be able to wear this with like, of course a t-shirt underneath, but like later I like it with the turtleneck as well and like layer for like colder weather. And then eventually you can also wear it as a shirt. Like so you just button it up and you tuck it in your trousers or your jeans, for example. Um, so you can wear it both ways, but I really like it open in a casual uh, styling. The price point is 246 euros, also from Revolve. This is the second pair of jeans uh, that I've ordered, so I, I got two new pairs, uh, very quite different from the ones that I showed you before. And this is the Carolina from Girlfriend Denim. I already had them, but in a different wash. And if you watch some of my previous denim uh, videos, I said it before, so when I find a pair of jeans that fit my body shape really well, I tend to reorder the same style, just in different wash, because, I don't know, with jeans, I feel that a pair of jeans, it looks amazing, but when it fits really perfect, and then it is not easy, also because there is so many, it is not easy to find the perfect um, denim that fits your body shape. So when I find it, I tend to stick to it and then order, you know, different washes of the same styling. So this specific style, it is from Girlfriend Denim, is the Carolina High Rise Straight Crop. So uh, it's like very high waisted, straight leg, um, it's not a raw hem, it's like a normal stitched hem and it is quite uh, cropped on your ankle and this I like it because it's the kind of denim that I really like also in, so now I wear it with like heels or sneakers for example like flat shoes, uh, loafers in winter I also really like to tuck this in high uh, knee boots and uh, when I do that type of styling inside the boots I need a pair of jeans that are like quite uh, of a skinny leg so I think these are perfect as well to take into winter. It's not a huge haul like I only have three pieces left but I'm trying to be very considerate with the things I order so things that I can wear and wear and wear again in like different styling so that's why all the pieces are quite basic if you want to I call them basic with the twist so uh, but it's not crazy colors or like crazy trendy pieces I don't really do trends anymore like everything that you see in my channel or my Instagram is pretty much things that you can rewear towards the years like quite classics and like investment pieces um, so next up I loved it on the website when I put it on I loved it even more like I think it is such a flattering fitting. First of all, uh, in terms of fitting, I sized up and I do this a lot when there is like a very slouchy, puffy sleeve because I like it to be even bigger. Um, and it turns out really well, so it is perfect on my body and I'm quite tall, so uh, sometimes I need to size up for the length. And then you have this very puffy and slouchy sleeves like so puffy shoulder big sleeve and then a cuff at the end so uh, it doesn't come like very big on top of your hands if you know what I mean that can be I love it but it can be not very practical sometimes uh, so the cuff it makes sure that your sleeve is big but it's not coming on your way so uh, I love this one the last two pieces are two dresses. One, I had it already in a different color and the other one is new. I wore so many dresses in the summer. To me, it is the most comfortable thing. I just love wearing a dress. It's like no brainer when, if I'm in a rush and I don't know what to wear, I wear a dress and 
immediately you feel chic uh, and then I love them in winter as well with tights. Uh, I like them now with like bare legs and maybe a blazer uh, with sandals with like uh, high boots, uh, ankle boots, like sneakers as well. So I just love a neat dress uh, because you can easily dress them up and down. So this one I've got one in a light color and one in black. This is a rib knit material. Um, I sized up to a size large, I would normally be a medium and I'm so glad I did because it is quite tight but not in like an uncomfortable way, just like it's fitted uh, but also it is quite see-through uh, so I think in the cutaway I was wearing like black underwear and you can see it um, so maybe uh, I will wear this with like a light slip dress underneath because uh, I don't like it to be see-through especially in like this time of it like if I'm at the beach but like if I'm in the city I don't like to have like a see-through dress so I think I have like a light slip uh, very thin silk dress I will wear it underneath and then I really like these like now bare legs but then also to take in winter uh, with tights Last but not least, it is another knit dress, this one. I already had it from last year in Camel, loved it, wore it a lot, same styling as that I explained for the light one, so I thought like, okay, now I can invest in more colors. It is quite of a good price point, it's 149 euros. Um, this one is a bit more dressy than the white one because this is like a bit backless. It's not a very deep um, V at the back but there is a little bit of it uh, showing your back and I'm going to London next week so for sure uh, we're gonna go to dinner out and I'm gonna pack this with me because it is comfortable but at the same time I can dress it up so it's those kind of pieces that I like to pack when I'm traveling because I can wear it during the day even just with sneakers and then I can dress it up with heels for a dinner or like an event at night. It comes in five colors so this is the black I've got the camel as well and then it comes in sage green white and a sort of like ginger color if you like colors it's not for me I wouldn't get that one personally but I don't wear colors and um, yeah I come closer so you can see the rib fabric but it's just like I think another great uh, staple piece for like fall winter and again it's things that you can just keep wearing year after year. Okay guys this is it it was not a huge haul but it's the new pieces that I've ordered for the fall uh, so I just wanted to show you let me know which one was your favorite so everything is gonna be linked in the description box as I said in the beginning of the video don't forget to subscribe to my channel I know I'm not like super consistent with the videos but we almost have 10k subscribers that, uh, so I'm quite happy about that uh, my little YouTube family um, and um, also let me know the type of videos that you want to see for uh, the fall winter. I already had a few requests to make a capsule wardrobe video for fall. So I'm in London next week, but I think I'm going to film it when I'm back. So let me know if it's something that you want to watch. And uh, yeah, just leave me your suggestions in the comments. Okay, see you next time. Bye.